Morning, everybody. I just got home from PT. Dogs are fighting like always. But I gotta get ready. I gotta eat something. I gotta make my lunch. And I gotta get out of here because I gotta get to the motor by nine. Hey, hey, cut it out. So, yeah. Head upstairs, change, shower. Just get ready. Kids are at school. Um, Marcus had an, appoint an, an appointment this morning, so he will not be. Please don't judge my bedroom. Um, so he will not be coming home tonight. Right, well, not tonight. He had an appointment this morning, so he won't be coming home this morning. He's just going to go straight to his appointment and go straight to work. <sighs> It's Monday, and these dogs just keep keep fighting with each other. I'm so over it. <sighs> it's rainy and gloomy, but it's like 60 degrees outside. It's crazy. All right, I'm gonna go and get ready. So when you see me, I will be either getting ready or already ready. So. So the struggle is real right now. <laughs> I recently chopped off all my hair and I thought it was a good idea, but being in the military, females have to keep their hair in a bun or keep their hair um, away from touching their collars. So every morning I struggle trying to put my hair up in a bun and uh, I have to use a ton of hairspray so that my hair doesn't move throughout the day and I find that this helps so yeah um, this morning I really didn't want to use any um, makeup so I noticed my skin was quite shiny so I decided to put some mattifying powder on um, but that day I just really did not feel like putting any makeup on so this is what I was able to do <laughs> my face and my hair is put together I just sit here and put my boots on don't mind the laundry in the background I folded it last night and I was super tired and the kids were already asleep and I didn't have time to put them away so that's why they're on the couch at the moment <music> dogs like to come and you know check out what I'm doing <laughs> uh, but they like to just hang out with me for a little bit while I'm here and then I like to go back into the bedroom and pretty much just straighten up um, our living area and fold the blankets so that way when we come home it's just not a complete disaster <music> that day where I need some coffee but I decided to use different glasses this morning I have a ton of glasses and kind of chalked it up to that the um, 
prescription that my doctor, my optometrist did for me for my contacts are not the right ones because it's giving me migraines. So I have to email him and let him know that he wrote the wrong prescription because my glasses prescription um, does not match my contacts prescription. So I'm going to see if he can rewrite it for me and see if I can return the contacts um, to get things that I actually need. So, Alright, let's do some coffee. This is my favorite coffee creamer. It's the Italian sweet cream. So good. I haven't really started my fall coffee creamers yet, but that's been my favorite for months right now and love it. But I'm just going to eat some breakfast and um, make my lunch for the day. Um, I find it that it's easier to have my lunch at work as opposed to going out and buying it and having to rush through my lunch time so I've been bringing my lunch in and it's super convenient so I'm just gonna make myself a turkey and cheese sandwich and pack some string cheese that I'm having right now is I'm getting tired of the snacks that I currently bring to work with my lunch um, I just I can't break the mold so if you guys have any suggestions of awesome snacks that you guys um, take to work or have throughout the day let me know in the comments below um, I would really appreciate it done eating my breakfast and packing my lunch I put my top on and Zeal already knows that I'm heading out and that's why she's like stuck on me right now but I just make sure that my collar's straight that my patches are placed correctly my uniform is good to go and once that's ready I'm ready to head out the door share something with you guys <laughs> this morning when um, I woke up I came to check on the hamsters and I always do every morning I always come and check on the hamsters in their cage to make sure that they're still good and that no one tried to escape 
but I thought this was super funny. <laughs> they took all their food and put it up here. They have a bowl of food, but it looks like they sifted through it and put all the grains there and all like the nuts and corn up here and the seeds and stuff. They're absolutely funny. What are you doing? Huh? Are you guys preparing for winter? <laughs> but yeah, I thought that was really funny and I wanted to share that with you guys. Hey guys, so didn't really film much of an intro, but happy October 1st. Um, for all of you who enjoy Halloween, this is your month. Um, I'm not a very big Halloween person. I don't, I mean, I decorate for it and I um, take my kids out and stuff like that. But I'm not like this huge Halloween person, like face makeup and all that stuff. Like some YouTubers out there, I don't do much of that. Um, but I do love the spirit of Halloween. So, anyways... It is October 1st, and how fitting to bring in October 1st, Washington. It, in Washington, it decides to rain, so it's nice and gloomy, but it is 56 degrees right now. So it's not that bad, but it's definitely fall. But it could be, it could, it could be colder. Today is Monday, Motor Pool Monday. Uh, today for PT, we kind of, we just ran. It's cardio day. Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays are cardio days. Tuesdays and Thursdays are more like muscle failure days. But, um, they played a game, like a tag game or whatever, and I just kind of ran on my own. Um... Decided to switch up the glasses today. Uh, went with the black frames. I have a ton of glasses. Um, and like I said earlier, my optometrist like screwed up my prescription. Like he wrote the wrong prescription. So that's what was giving me the migraine. So I haven't been wearing my contacts because of that. So I'm going to see if he can rewrite my prescription. And I want to see if 1-800-CONTACTS will allow me to return the um, wrong prescription and order a new one because I can't use them and contacts are expensive. The ones I get is $100 a box. Um, it's the monthly prescription. Um, so if I can't even use it, like what am I supposed to do with it? So I'm hoping that 1-800-CONTACTS can um, take the box back I only used one lens out of the box like so one eye is fine it's the other eye that he wrote wrong um, and it's giving me it's giving me migraines so hopefully they can return it I can get my right prescription and everything will be right in the world <laughs> normally Mondays we go to the motor pool for um, motor pool stables we check our vehicles and make sure that they're working and that there are no, like, it's just like simple maintenance pretty much. Um, and normally we go from 9 to lunchtime, which is around 11.30. So, update you guys on something. Um, so, Marcus and I are trying something new with our finances. Uh, Typically, I'm the one that controls all of our finances. I'm the one who um, pays all the bills. I'm the one that budgets everything, and he just spends. He is a spender. He um, doesn't look at our accounts, nothing. He just swipes away and thinks that there's like endless amounts of money in there and that everything will be covered. Well, that's not how it works, honey. <laughs> um, so we had a discuss. We, we we talked about our finances and how we spend. I'm very frugal. I like to go to the thrift store on post. I like to go to the Goodwills um, around our area to find things like 
instead of buying brand new stuff, especially when it comes to the kids' clothes. Um, every, every once in a while I will go and get them new clothes because, you know, what kid doesn't deserve new clothes? I don't buy their shoes from the thrift store, um, only because of, um, most of the time I see the, the shoes at the thrift store, they're, like, not in good condition, not in great condition, and my kids beat up their shoes, so if something's not in great condition, like, it's not gonna, it's not gonna last very long so I always have to buy their shoes brand new but most of their clothes like I can get away with at the, at the thrift store the Goodwill um, and I've always I like I've been shopping like that ever since we bought our new house because obviously a mortgage is very expensive and then not only that but I'm saving money um, for you know vacations for the kids college I'm setting up like a savings account for Max and Gabby so that way when they're old enough they will have you know some kind of money um, in a savings account for them when they do go decide if they do decide to go off to college if not like they can use it to go and buy a new car you know um, or their first car like we'll have something for them um, yeah so I've been doing that um, and Marcus just, I guess, you know, no fault to him, but he just assumed that, you know, everything was fine and dandy, but it, it really wasn't. Um, so we sat down and, you know, we discussed where all our money is going and how he spends and how, how, how I spend. And pretty much we came to the idea of once all the bills are paid and whatever's left, we were going to um, divide it up between the two of us. Money between the both of us, right? So, um, he didn't even realize, you know, what, what is what. <laughs> um, and honestly, I want to perhaps do a separate vlog explaining like, how it's working out, how it's not working out, what were our surprises, uh, what issues we ran into kind of thing. So I'm kind of excited to see uh, how this works out. He was a little bit shook at some things. I've literally, I've been sitting here eating my lunch in the car. We got released pretty early for lunch around 10.30 and because of our financial game we're playing, I did not want to drive all the way home to drive back over here. So I just sat here and had my lunch um, across the field of the dog park. I've been watching the puppies run around. I don't know if you can see him or if they left, but there's one. There he is. I'm watching him run around the place. Um, and watching YouTube videos on my phone. I have 51% because I've been watching videos, so I turned my car on so I can, um, charge up my phone before I have to go into work. I have 30 more minutes left till I have to be back in my office. Um, so I figured I'd turn my car on and start charging my phone before it's time to go in and work. But I spoke to Marcus about what it is that I want to do for um, my next video. And he's totally for it. And I'm so excited. I can't wait to film that that video because I just want to know like what he thinks and like what he's learned and all that stuff. It's going to be hilarious. So he, I, I went home to go and change and everything and I packed my lunch like you guys saw. But he had an appointment at 8 o'clock and he did not pack a lunch. So he called me to figure out how much money he had left <laughs> when I told him 
how much money he had left, he was like, all right, I'm going to go and buy string cheese <laughs> to keep my blood sugar up. I was like, you are insane. Um, because he's been eyeing a backpack and it's quite costly. So I'm pretty sure that's what he's saving for. And then there's also another video game coming out that he's been eyeing and that he wants. So <laughs> he's trying to save his money. The rules are whatever you save from this paycheck rolls over to the next paycheck. Um, whatever is left for spending money after the bills. So I told him, um, you know, that's the rule. If if you didn't spend whatever you didn't spend on this from this paycheck, it rolls over to the next. So he is planning on buying some stuff. But I'll let you guys. I'll let him talk about the um, when we do our our video. I'll let him t discuss like what it was he was like his expectations, what his plans were, and all that stuff. Um, but yes, it is 12:30 right now. Like I said. I am charging my phone. I have to go into work. I have a few things that I need to get done, like um, med pros updates and stuff like that. I wanted to share something with you guys. This is our second subscription box with HelloFresh, and this is not paid or sponsored. We purchased both of our boxes ourselves, so. Um, we we seem to like it so far because this is our second box so we're we liked our first box so far um we are on the two meals a week plan for a family of four and they come pre-packaged like this and they're cold they have ice packs in it um but we have two meals for the week this is kind of new um inside this box it came with a gift of the month and it came with two lint Lindor chocolates. So that was new for us. We didn't have that in our first subscription But what's really convenient with the subscription service is that all your meals come packaged like this. So we got Italian noodle soup and then we got I'm Kind of struggling here to find show the enough the what we have we got these sweet and smoky chicken cutlets so what's really cool about this is that all your ingredients for one meal is in this bag and then you can you toss your your scraps in this bag which is super helpful when you're preparing and it's the same for this as well so I found that super convenient when we were actually prepping and actually cooking our meals also, on the bottom of your box, there is um, these cold packs, and if you get meals that require meat products, there's the other chocolate, <laughs> you will um, find the meats at the bottom of the box. So here we have the uh, sweet Italian chicken sausage mix for the soup, and then the chicken cutlets as well for the sweet and smoky chicken cutlets so um this package arrived sometime at noon and i didn't get home until six and everything was still nice and cold so they really pack it very well and um it's super convenient so i wanted to share that with you guys <music> that is all for today's vlog I hope you guys enjoyed watching this give me a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed the video um, don't forget to check out HelloFresh our family loves the meals that we've been prepping so far um, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel we would love for you all to be a part of our family and we've been uploading like maniacs so I really don't want you guys to miss out on any of our videos so um, yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.